How fast would a tensor's floating disk descend if I pulled it over a hole covered by a plank and then removed the plank so that the disk falls? If I was to make a floating disk over a hole covered by a plank, have a party member or some equipment placed on it and then go down that chasm or hole, would the disk follow at my levitate? speed 20 feet descent or ascent per turn or my movement speed 30 feet per turn or would it drop like a rock i'm picturing using it like a down elevator to be clear i am not asking about whether i can move the disc over a hole i am aware of that limitation and can easily put a plank over the hole and move the disc over the void i am only asking about the vertical movement speed of the disc how fast would a tensor's floating disc descend if i pulled it over a hole covered by a plank and then removed the plank so that the disc falls there's no way you can bring tensors floating disc down a long drop unless the terrain is itself moving. Ask your GM what it means when the terrain moves out from under your floating disc because the game has no mechanism to let you know that before you try it.